so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Blippi! Hey, it's me, Blippi. And today we're at Dig This in Las Vegas, Nevada. Whoa! Ha ha! And today, you and I are going to learn about the word crush. Do you know the word crush? Yeah, it means to destroy, pulverize, and just smash things. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Wait a second. Do you see what I see? Yeah, eggs. Whoa, three eggs. One, two, three. <laughs> I love eggs. But today, I'm not going to eat this egg. Today, I'm going to crush this egg. Ready? <laughs> okay, let's find some more things to crush. <laughs> Woo! Hey, look! Whoa! Look at what it is! It's a soda can! I think we should crush this! But be sure to never try this at home. And the only reason why I'm gonna do it is because I have shoes on. Alright, here we go! things. That was awesome! Oh hey, perfect! Look at what it is! This is a watermelon. It looks like it's ready to be crushed. Oh! Are you ready? Oh! Whoa! <laughs> yeah! That's awesome! <laughs> yeah! Look! The watermelon <laughs> All right, let's see what else we can find and crush. Oh, wait a second. No way. There's a car right there. Let's crush the car. All right. Whoa, 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 whoa. Before I crush the car, I need to wear my safety gear. All right. Whoa. <laughs> I have a bright yellow. Safety vest. Perfect. All right. And then I got my hard hat and safety glasses. All right. Oh, oh, wait a second. This needs to be perfect. Okay, here we go. Oh, hoo -hoo. all right. Let's give it a whirl. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> trying to crush it, but it's not really working. Let's try the door. <laughs> oh, interesting. <sighs> I'm not getting very far. All right, one last one. <laughs> All right, anywho, I have an idea. We need a bigger tool for this job, but before that, Let's write crush on it. Perfect. All right, we have some spray paint. We have red, green, blue, pink, and black. So first, let's take some white paint, all right? Pour some in right there, and let's and let's give it a nice white base coat. All right, <laughs> yeah, woohoo, yeah. There we go, perfect. A little bit more white right there. All right. Now, 
Let's take our colorful spray paint and let's paint the word crush on it. All right, let's start with the color green. Perfect. All right, what other colors do we have? Let's do red. R. Now let's do black. Oh yeah! Just two more letters. C R U. Let's use the color pink now. Last letter, C-R-U-S, the color blue for the letter H. Oh, look, I wrote the word crush on it. All right, C-R-U-S. H. Now we're ready to crush this. So let's get a big machine for this. Ha -ha. And the perfect machine is a toy excavator. Whoa, what better machine to destroy and crush this car than an excavator? But wait a second, this toy can't do it. That's why I have a real excavator! All right, let's crush this car! Hey, first things first, let's keep this toy excavator right back there. Let's put on our headset. All right. Perfect. All right, and now let's put on our hard hat. Okay, so let's take our safety belt. Yeah, just like the seat belt in your car. Now that we're all strapped in, we're ready to crush.
I'm an excavator. Excavator. I'll teach you. All you gotta do is bring up your arm, like it's the arm and the boom in the bucket, and start to scoop. <laughs> That's fun! I've got a place where workers sit, it's called a cab Where they control the bucket to scoop and grab I'm a whole regulator, I'm an excavator Oh, can't you see that I work all day? Do you ever sleep? No time for sleep I'm an excavator Go check it out. Come on. Whoa! Look, look the letters. C R U S H. Crush. Whoa! Look at it. It's so crushed. Whoa! Here's the steering wheel. Whoa! And the seats and the windshield. Wow! That was crazy. Well, thank you so much for learning about the word crush with me. And hey, special thanks to Dig This in Las Vegas, Nevada. Well, see you later, kids. Bye bye. So much to learn about, it'll make you want to shout Blippi! Hey, it's me, Blippi! And today we're at the Pacific Science Center in Seattle, Washington. This is going to be so much fun. Come on. Whoa! Look at this place! This place is awesome! Ooh! Now we're in the butterfly room. Have you ever seen a butterfly before? Yeah! I love butterflies. They're so beautiful and light. Will you act like a butterfly with me? Whoa! Look at him go! Whoa! one right there. Hey, butterfly. Whoa. <laughs> Check it out. A butterfly just landed on me. So anytime they land on you, you don't want to touch them. And they're actually just being really nice. So you can be nice back to them. See? <laughs> I 
love butterflies because they're so bright and, and some are camouflaged though. Look, can you find one? Whoa, look! This butterfly uses camouflage for its defense mechanism. Just in case if there's any predators, then the predators can't see it. <laughs> see? <laughs> Hi! Alright, now I'm with Lorraine, and what are you going to show us? So this here is a Madagascar hissing cockroach. I can take Ooh. it out for you. And what am I going to do with it? You can hold it if you'd like. Sure, let's try take it. Out. <gasps> I'm about to hold a Madagascar hissing cockroach. Alright, hold your hand out really still. Ooh. There you go. Oh, that's nice. I like this cockroach. Hey, how are you? Hey. Do you see it? See, I'm being nice to it, and it's being nice to me. Hey, how are you? What did you do today? Did you enjoy your food? Yeah. Ooh, now we get to touch some animals. But first, we need to wash our hands. So then our hands are nice and clean. Okay. That's good. Let's go, come on. Ooh, look at this. Wow. <laughs> okay, what do we have here? Well, over there we have some anemones. They're really friendly and kind of squishy. You're doing a really good job petting it with one or two fingers on the side. We don't really want to poke it right in the middle because that's its mouth. Oh, cool. Ooh, look at this one. So the last ones are really soft. I wonder what this is gonna feel like. Whoa, it looks like it's closing itself up a little bit. Blippi, it, it might think you're food. Ooh, that's funny. Oh, look at this one. What's this? That over there is a sea star. How does it feel? Whoa. Kind of. Bumpy, maybe? Yeah, bumpy and 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 kind of small spikes. The last couple were really soft, but this one is hard. Those little dots are made out of the same stuff that seashells are made out of. Ooh. So even as though a sea star doesn't have a, its own seashell, it's kind of like it has little bits of a seashell. Wow, that's pretty cool. Well, thank you so much. My pleasure. <laughs> bye bye. Bye. Oh, I found the queen! Wow, there's so many honeybees in here. Hey, don't be scared of honeybees. All they're trying to do is make some honey. Yeah! Have you ever had honey before? Yeah, it's so tasty! Look at what it is! This is the spot where you can do the bee dance. Are you ready to learn the bee dance? I'll teach you. Okay, in the middle here, you go and do a little wiggle. <laughs> then you go this way. Flap your wings. Yep, because we want to make some honey. In the middle. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. And then go this way. Flap your wings. And then since you're back in the middle, you wiggle, 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 and go this way. And then you keep doing it until you're really tired. All right, ready? Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Flap your wings. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Flap your wings. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Flap your wings. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Oh, I'm tired. Oh, that was awesome. Good job. Oh, now we're in the living things exhibit. Oh, look. Hey, look at what it is. It's a crayfish. Do you see it right there? Oh, here's one right here. Hey, how are you? <laughs> Ooh, and up top there's some fish. Hey fish, are you just swimming around? Yeah, they are. Oh, oh, look over here. Some giant grasshoppers. Ooh, grasshoppers can jump really high. 
I bet they live in the grass a lot of times. Eh, that's why they're called grass hoppers. A lot of times they live in the grass and they hop really high. <laughs> Let's go see what else there is. Whoa, look at this room. Another part of the Living Things exhibit. Whoa. Yeah, do you see these? Whoa, interesting. These are naked mole rats. Wow. They're like rats, but they have no fur or or hair or scales or anything like that. That's why they're called naked mole rats. <laughs> oh, and an axolotl. Check this out. Whoa. See that? That's an axolotl. Whoa, so interesting. Kind of looks like a salamander mixed with a fish. But the cool thing about axolotls are if they lose a limb like their arm, then from there, they can regrow it back. Woo! <laughs> Check out this little person or guy or girl or I don't even know, but this is a turtle. Wow. Hey, how are you, turtle? Are you having a good day? Are you having fun? Yeah. <laughs> you sure do look like you're having fun. <laughs> See you later. Whoa. It's kind of dark in here, but that's okay. This is a green iguana. Can you see it? Whoa. It's just relaxing. Having a good time. <laughs> All right. See you, iguana. Right there is a dinosaur. They don't live on our planet anymore, but they used to. Look at it. It kind of looks like a velociraptor. Will you act like a velociraptor with me? Whoa, another dinosaur. Whoa, this dinosaur, that's its name right there. It's really big. Hey, look at its head. <laughs> Hey! See? It kind of looks like it's wearing a helmet. Just like when you and I ride bicycles, we wear helmets. <laughs> cool! Oh, here's some more dinosaurs. Whoa, look at that one. That is a triceratops. Do you know why they call it a triceratops? Yep, because it has three horns on its face and head. Let's count them. One, two, three. <laughs> All right, see you later, Triceratops. Oh. Hey, another dinosaur. Wow. Hey, dinosaur. Oh, this dinosaur right here was a herbivore. <laughs> see, these plants, that means it eats plants. <laughs> and plants only, it doesn't eat meat. And look at what's on its head. <laughs> it kind of looks like a shark fin. <laughs> so silly. <laughs> Whoa. Check this out. Whoa, this is a massive footprint. Okay, let's compare my foot to this dinosaur's foot. Ready? Its foot is way bigger than mine. It's even way bigger than two of my feet. Whoa, another dino. Check it out. This is a Stegosaurus. Whoa, do you see those plates on its back? That's for its defense mechanism. Wow. Hey, Stegosaurus. <laughs> oh. So many cool dinosaurs in here. Whoa! This dinosaur is so scary. It's the king and queen of the dino land. Whoa! 
I'm gonna act like this dinosaur, okay? Will you do the same? Ready? <laughs> I love acting like a dinosaur. <laughs> Woo, now we're gonna do the high rise bike. Oh, all right. Come on, come here. You gotta buckle up. Whoa. I'll also tell you a few quick things before you go. Okay. Uh, just make sure you're going at like a walking pace. You're always going forwards and just keep pedaling the whole time. Okay. Uh, hands are optional. Whoa, hands are optional. Here I go. Whoa. I would fall off because it's a really thin rail, but I didn't because the weight is really heavy and it's really far away from me. Here I go! Woo! <laughs> Whoa! Look at this! Interesting! This looks like a giant circle! <laughs> and this is actually called the water wheel. It's kind of just like how a hamster runs in their wheel. I'm gonna do the same, but it's gonna grab water from the bottom and throw it up over the top. Ready? Here I go. Whoa! Did you see that? That was awesome. Whoa, what's this? Ooh, this is the water power station. Water is getting shot out on the front of this little water gun. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> okay, watch, I'll make that spin. Yeah, we're doing it. Whoa, okay. Whoa, what's that way up there? Do you see that? Yeah, that's the Seattle Space Needle. I think we should take the water power gun and try and shoot way up there. Here we go. Oh, it's such a nice day. I wanted to give them a cool break of water, but it's too high up there. Let's go see what else there is around here. Pretty fun. Whoa! Look at this area. You can use these water squirters to squirt inside this clear cube. <laughs> All right, let's see what else there is. Whoa, look at this. All right, I wonder if I put this right here. Yeah, see? The water is pushing this gear around. Okay, let's try this one. Whoa, look. Both of these are going in circle. The red one and the yellow one. Ooh. Come on. I love playing with water. Whee. Okay. Whoa. Whoa. Wow. <laughs> Okay, look in there, let's go. Ooh. Welcome, come on in. Hey, look, it's a little tree house. Here I go. Hello. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Whoa, look at this. It's a bunch of spirals, ups, downs, lefts and rights. Here we go. Whee! Whoa! 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 <laughs> this is so much fun. 
The noise room. Come on. Whoa. This room is a room that you can make as much noise as you want. First thing I'm gonna do is yell. <laughs> now, let's use the things around us to make some noise. And if we're lucky, maybe it will sound like music. Shiny bowls! right up here. Whoa, this area has a lot of colorful bricks. Yeah, see? Right over here. All right. Timber! <laughs> Whoa, a taller one. Let's count how many there are. This is a lot of stories of bricks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Eighteen bricks coming down! Whoa! Whoa! Oh, that was awesome! Okay. Let's uh, organize these bricks in their different colors, okay? Okay, since we made a mess, we need to take the green bricks, put them over here, okay? Okay, there's the green bricks. And let's now take the blue bricks and put them right there. Awesome. Perfect. Oh, hey, look. Here's some brown bricks. Let's put them right here. Hey. Here's a red brick. Let's put it right there. Okay. Hey, here's some more blue bricks. Oh, look at this one. What color is that? Yeah, this is brown. Let's stack it right there. Hey, look at all these. What color is this? Do you know what color this is? Yeah, it's the color yellow. Let's put these right over here. Okay, so when those 18 bricks fell down, they were comprised of these one, two, three, four, Five colors, and those colors are green, brown, blue, red, and yellow. Good job. Let's see what other fun things they have at the Pacific Science Center. Let's go. Do you like numbers? Yeah, I do too. What about big numbers? Yeah! Check this out. This is a big number. 76,383,232. Whoa, that's a big number. But when I push this red button, watch this number. Whoa, it just went up by one. See, it's at three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten. Every time you push this button, it goes up by one. So if you ever come to the Pacific Science Center, 
you can see what number it's at, because I am going to leave it at 76,383,323. Wait, no. 324? <laughs> hmm. Oh, hey! I'm just doing this puzzle of the moon. Okay, there's one. Let's see. Okay. Hey, there's another. Um, yeah, that looks about right. Perfect. We're almost done. Look. Yeah. This is our moon. We live on planet Earth. And we have one moon. And we call it moon. <laughs> wow, how clever of us. Hey, look at what it is. This is a planet. Just like how we live on planet Earth, this is a planet in our solar system. And this is Saturn. Ooh. And the biggest planet in our solar system is Jupiter. Whoa, it is really big. Look at that. Come here. This is a space capsule. Watch your step. See? This capsule is where astronauts can sit in and go into outer space so then they can feel the effects of gravity and they can push all these cool knobs. Ready? Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> yeah, look! I just made all those things light up. Whoa, this is fun. Whoa! It's like I can see planet Earth all the way from out here. Whoa! Hey, Mom! <laughs> Woo! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> just kidding. It was just a mirror. Come over here. I'll show you some more fun that we can have with mirrors. Ooh, look at this. Whoa. <laughs> I call this the mirror dance. <laughs> I look silly. Come on. Ooh, this is a bubble maker. All right, I'm gonna lift this up. Nice and slow. And I'm gonna blow now. Yeah, I did it! Did you see that? That was awesome! I love making bubbles. Ooh, and you know what else I love? Is taking a giant lever and seeing how distance way out here makes it really easy compared to to lift up this weight compared to go down right here. See, watch. Huh, interesting. All right, now. Let's move it way out here. All right. Now I'll do it with one hand. Yeah, did you see it? Look, I'll lift it up. Whoa, that's pretty interesting. Whoa, hey, a cool mirror. Another one. Hey, hello. This is interesting. See, I'm upside down. But in real life, I'm right side up. Hello. Hey, I see you. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> All right, let's continue on. This place is so cool. Hey, what's this? This is a beach ball. What's it doing here? Flying ball. Feel the power of air in motion. Huh, interesting. Let's push this. Whoa! I wonder what happens when I plug this hole that's shooting up all the air. Whoa, did you see that? All right. Now I wonder what happens when I move it. Ah, yum! 
I just hydrated my body with a lot of water because what I'm about to show you <laughs> takes a lot of energy. I'll show you my Lance Armstrong hill climb. Woohoo! That was awesome! Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B L I P P I. Blippi, good job. Special thanks to the Pacific Science Center for making this video happen. Bye bye. So much to learn about, it'll make you want to shout Blippi. Hey, it's me, Blippi. And today we're at the Bellevue, Washington Fire Station. And today we're going to learn about fire trucks, ambulances, and the fire station. Look at what it is. This is a big red fire truck. Whoa, come check it out. Ooh. Wow, look at all these gauges. Huh, so interesting. Hey, look. It's a compartment with a lot of cool things in it. All right, let's go look at the fire station. Come on. Whoa. <laughs> All right, check out in here. So it's really important for firefighters to stay nice and fit. Like over here, these weights. Uh, 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 ooh. These are bicep curls and they make your arms nice and strong. Whew. It's really important for firefighters to stay in shape because when they go in houses that are burning, they might need to carry someone down the stairs or up the stairs and then down the ladder. <laughs> oh, hey, look. Whoa. Medicine balls. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I love exercising. Hey, some jump ropes. Have you ever jumped rope before? Check this out. See, every time I jump, the rope goes underneath my feet one time. And now, I'm gonna make it go, oh, <laughs> I messed up. I'm gonna make it go under my feet two times every time. <laughs> Twice. <laughs> Whoa, that's tiring. <sighs> Being physically fit is really fun. All right, this is a treadmill. It's where you can walk and then be in one place. See? And you can also run. Whoa. Here I go! Oh, it's getting faster and faster! Whoa! Now I just went really fast. Alright, hit the tunes! Oh, that's fun! Last but not least, the bench press. This is a great way to keep your upper body nice and fit. So then, like I said, firefighters can help people and they're nice and strong. Yeah! All right, now let me show you the rest of the fire station. Come on. Check this out. Whoa. <laughs> so, not only do firefighters eat healthy and exercise at the fire stations, they also have to sleep because firefighters are here day and night. And just like you and I, firefighters need to sleep. And the reason why firefighters have a 
bed at the fire station is because they need to be really close to the fire trucks and ambulances just in case if there's an emergency. So, nighty night. Oh, wait a second. No time for sleeping now. I want to show you an ambulance. Let's go. Ooh, look at what it is. It's a medic unit, also known as an ambulance. Let's go check it out, come on. Let's look inside the cab. Whoa, now we're inside the ambulance. All right, let's shut the door. First things first, safety first. Let's put on our seat belt. All right, here it is. <laughs> All right, now we're ready. Whoa, what's this? It looks like a giant map. Whoa, you can use this so then you can see where you're gonna go. Um, right there. <laughs> All right, oh, a computer? Whoa, this tells you where you're gonna go, like the address, the information, all about the call that you're doing. Oh, hey, look, a steering wheel. <laughs> that was the horn. Hey, move, we're going to help some people. Whoa, whoa, what are these? These are headsets, listen. Hello, hello, it's Medic Blippi. Do you need help? All right, we're gonna come help you. <laughs> That's awesome. Whoa. Check this out down here. The siren. Listen. <laughs> if you ever hear that and you're in a vehicle or on the sidewalk, get to the side because the ambulance is going to help someone. All right, and this right here turns on all of the lights. Go check them out. Whoa, the lights are so bright. Oh, check out this compartment. I wonder what's inside. Oh, hey. <laughs> this right here is a heart rate monitor. It gives all the medics the information about your heart. And this, this, yeah, is a medical unit pack. Whoa, there's so many interesting things in here. Whoa, hey, like a stethoscope. Whoa, <laughs> I could hear my heart beat. Wow, that is so interesting. All right, let's lock this back up and go check out what else is around here. Ooh, whoa, another compartment. This is where all the firefighter gear is. See, here's some jackets. Oh, hey, and here's even a helmet that they wear when they go into areas with fires. Hey, do you know another time that you should wear a helmet? when you ride a bicycle. <laughs> All right. Oh, the back of the ambulance. Oh, get ready. Whoa, look at this. This is the stretcher. Watch out, here it comes. This is what you might get a lay on sometime. And if you do, just be very calm. The people are trying to help you. All right, let's leave this right here. <laughs> All right. Oh, let's go inside the back of the ambulance. Let's go. Oh, here we are. 
This is another entrance. Come on. Whoa! It's so bright and light in here. Wow. Very interesting. Oh, hey. Look at what it is. It's another stethoscope. <laughs> Put it on my ears. Listen. Do you hear that? Yeah, that's my heart beating. I'm nice and healthy. <laughs> All right, put that right there. What else is around here? Oh, hey, look, rubber gloves. I'll put one of these on. Oh. All right, these keep my hands nice and clean when I'm working in the back of the ambulance. Hey, what color is this? Yeah, it's the color blue. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, look at this. Ew. Do you see this? That's Mr. Yuck. If you ever see Mr. Yuck somewhere, do not eat it. Don't drink it. And we should probably stay away. <laughs> Let's look in another cupboard. Hey, like this one. Wow. That's interesting. A lot of medications and things to help people if you're in trouble. Hey, just know, if you ever need to ride in an ambulance, be careful, be nice and calm because the people in here are just trying to help you. Well, let's go have some more fun. Whoa, what is that? That looks like a hospital on wheels. It's an ambulance. It's an ambulance. It's an ambulance. It's a little hospital on wheels. It's a vehicle that can transport people who are sick or hurt to the nearest hospital with a medical team that rides around, always ready for people who need help it's now. It's an ambulance. It's an ambulance. It's an ambulance. It's a little hospital on it's wheels. It's an ambulance. It's an ambulance, it's an ambulance, it's a little hospital on wheels. You can call it up in emergencies, the siren turns on and it races to the scene. Some are yellow and green, some red, white or blue, but they're all here to help me and you. So many neat things in an ambulance, like oxygen tanks and first aid kits. There's a stretcher in the back. The patient lays on, they've got bandages and medicine And a siren on top of the dome When the siren turns on, all the cars move it's out of the ambulance. way It's an ambulance, it's an ambulance, it's an ambulance It's a little hospital on it's wheels It's an ambulance, it's an ambulance, it's an ambulance It's a little hospital on wheels And remember boys and girls in a real emergency. It's an ambulance. It's an ambulance. It's an ambulance. It's a little hospital on wheels. All right, now let me show you one of my favorite parts. <laughs> Come on. Ooh, yeah, this is the kitchen. And this is a fridge <laughs> with a lot of food in it. Here's another one. Wow. Firefighters work really long days and nights, and so they have to have a kitchen so they can eat and stay nice and healthy. Oh, hey, look, here's some food. Ooh, this looks tasty. We have some salad, a potato, we even have some chips. Ooh, and a strawberry. Yum. So what we're doing now is we're just getting ready for a training exercise. Yeah, we're doing really good. What's that? Yeah, I see lights. I hear a siren. That must mean that there's a fire. We gotta go help some people. Let's go, come on. Oh, do you hear that? That's the sirens and the lights. We need to get all of our fire equipment on. Okay. First, 
our pants and the boots. We need to take off our shoes. One shoe. Two shoes. All right, I need to hurry. All right, there we go. Got my boots on. <laughs> All right, here we go. Pull off my pants. Nice, nice and buckled. Put on my suspenders over my orange suspenders. All right, tight, tighten that up. Oh, all right, Ooh, my jacket. Ugh. Put this on. All of this will keep me safe when I'm at the fire. All right, here we go. We need to zip it up. Ooh, here's the zipper. Put it in there like that. There we go. Velcro. Okay, uh, then we have the helmet. This will keep my head safe. Perfect, tighten it up. And then last but not least, my two gloves. <laughs> All right. Man, I got ready really quick because I don't know what's happening there. All right, let's go. Okay, we're gonna go to the fire. Let's go. and it's full of water, we can put out the fire. Oh, here we go. something else really cool to show you. First, I need to take off my helmet. Let's put that right up there. The next thing I have to do is put on a mask. This goes all around my head to keep my ear and my hair safe. <laughs> all right. Woo, all right, check out my sweet hood. <laughs> yeah, this is the color black. All right. The next piece of equipment I'm gonna put on is this mask. This mask is gonna help protect my eyes and then be able to deliver clean oxygen so I can breathe in the smoke. Are you ready? Ooh, look at me now. I have my mask on. Hey, if there's a firefighter trying to help you, they might look like this, but that's okay. They're not scary. They're just trying to help you. Okay, let me put on my helmet now. There we go. Now that it's nice and snug, I'm gonna put on the air tank. Ooh, yeah. Look, it's an air tank. This is what provides air to me. Just like Now I can breathe when I'm going through a burning house. Do you hear that? 
So what that is, is air coming from the tank, going through the tube into my mouth. So then smoke doesn't come inside. All right, let's go check out some more of the fire station. Woo! All right, now let me show you some of the parts of the fire truck. Whoa, look at this. This is a really big wheel and tire. Whoa, it's silver and black. <laughs> okay, let me show you inside the fire truck. Check it out. Oh, that's really neat in there. They look like they're ready to go to a fire. <laughs> oh, look at this. Whoa, there are so many gauges. Oh, interesting. There's so many, I don't even know what they're for. <laughs> Ooh, look at in here. Whoa, one compartment. Another compartment. And this compartment has fire extinguishers. Let's count them. One, two, three. Good job, come on. Interesting, more things. Like a little broom. It's nice and clean. Let's go to the back. Ooh, wait, where are you going? Come over here. Do you see those? There's so many different sizes of hoses. Oh, interesting. All right, what else do we have? Hey, here's a compartment. Whoa, look in there. Whee! This is a really big ladder. So then the firefighters can go up really high and save people off of roofs and windows. I'll lock it back up. There we go. Ooh, what's in here? Huh, hey! Yeah, a chainsaw! Wow, there's so much great equipment on a fire truck. Hey, another compartment. Hey, bolt cutters. An axe. Wow. Even look. Yeah. Even <laughs> a hammer. All right. I'll just set that right there. <laughs> Whoa. Look at this. This is where you connect the fire hydrant to the fire truck. And let me show you. Have you ever wondered what this thing is at a fire station? Yeah. This is what connects to the fire engine's exhaust. So then, no smoke from the fire truck goes inside. Yeah. All right, that was awesome. Woo. <laughs> that was so much fun learning about fire engines, medic units, <laughs> ambulances, and the life of a firefighter at the fire station. Hey, it's really important to know what number to call if there's an emergency. So be sure to ask a grown-up what number to call if there is an emergency, like a fire. Hey, it's also really important to have a working smoke detector and carbon monoxide detector. So then if there's ever a problem, it will chirp like this. Yeah, and then you can call the emergency number. So then you'll get some help. Well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? B-L-I-P-P-I. Flippy, good job. See you soon, bye-bye. So much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Flippy.